How to create and lock HTTP injector config files with inbuilt servers for online safety. Hello and welcome. In this tutorial, I'll guide you step-by-step -step on how to use HTTP injector to create and secure configuration files. These files are essential for accessing the internet safely and privately. We'll use the DNS TT method with inbuilt server settings for this setup. Let's dive in. Step one, install HTTP injector. One. Open the Google Play Store on your device. 2. Search for HTTP Injector and download the app. 3. After installation, open the app. You'll land on its home screen, which is the starting point for all configurations. Why this step is important. HTTP Injector is a popular tool for creating secure tunnels for your internet connection. It encrypts your traffic and allows you to set custom configurations for added safety. Step two, choose a connection. Type one. From the home screen, tap on the SSL TLS button. This opens a menu of available connection methods. Two, select DNS TT, DNS tunnel from the list. Three, once selected, tap save to confirm your connection type. Step three, access and select a server. One, tap the menu icon three horizontal lines in the top left corner to access additional options. Two, from the menu, select servers. Three, you'll see a list of available servers categorized under different connection types. Choose a DNS TT server from the list. Four, check the server's status to ensure it's online and functioning. This is typically displayed within the app. Five, tap on the server to select it, then click connect to finalize your choice. Why this step matters. Servers act as the backbone of your connection. A working server ensures smooth communication between your device and the internet, encrypting your traffic and providing reliable performance. Step four, start the connection. One, return to the home screen. Two, tap the start button to initiate the connection. What happens here? Once you tap start, HTTP injector establishes a secure connection to the selected server. This creates a tunnel for your internet traffic, ensuring your data is encrypted and safe from third parties. Step five, lock and export. Your configuration file. One, tap the export option on the screen. This allows you to save your current setup as a reusable file. Two, select export config from the options provided. Three, in the file name field, type a name for your configuration file. Four, Choose the connection method you used to create the file, e.g. DNS TT, and enable the SSH option for added security. Five, to protect the file, enable the following features. Lock, this prevents others from editing or modifying the file. Extra lock, this adds advanced security like expiry dates or restricted access to the file. Six, once done, tap the export button in the top right corner. Seven, Confirm by clicking save, and your file will be stored in the HTTP injector folder. Why lock your file? Locking your configuration ensures no unauthorized edits or misuse. Adding an expiry date through extra lock gives you control over how long the file remains usable. Step six, import a configuration file. One, to use a previously created configuration, tap import config. Two, Choose the internal storage option when prompted. Three, navigate to your device's documents folder and locate the HTTP injector folder. Four, select the file you want to import and it will load into the app. Why import a file? This feature is helpful when you want to quickly reuse or share a pre-configured setup without manually entering all settings again. Step seven, share the locked file. One, open your device's file manager app. If you don't have one, download files by Google from the Play Store. Two, navigate to internal storage and open the documents folder. Three, locate the HTTP injector folder where your exported files are saved. Four, tap the three dots next to the file you want to share, then select share. Five, choose an app that e.g. WhatsApp, Telegram, and select the contact or group you want to share it with. Why share a locked file? 
Sharing allows others to use your secure setup while ensuring your settings are protected and cannot be altered. By following these steps, you'll be able to create, lock, and share secure HTTP injector configuration files with ease. These practices not only enhance online safety, but also ensure your configurations remain private and effective. If you found this tutorial helpful, like this video, subscribe to the channel for more guides, comment with your questions or suggestions, share this with your friends to spread knowledge, join our Telegram and WhatsApp groups for more tips and updates. Links are in the description below. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next tutorial.